Welcome to Earth. We start our five-week journey into the realm of human spaceflight close to home here at KTH Royal Institute of Technology in Stockholm, Sweden. Let's begin with a low-level orbit around our home planet where we can see major land masses and the beautiful air and sea currents floating around them. As we look into Earth's night, the presence of our 7 billion people civilization is clearly visible through the lights of our major cosmopolitan centers. Humans have left a mark on Earth and we're now heading for the stars. Get ready, as we will now start our journey going faster than the speed of light in this ship of the imagination. We are now 35 light minutes from Earth, looking at the orbits of the inner planets of our solar system. At 10 light hours from home, we see in red the orbits of our most distant travelers, Voyager 1 and 2. We say goodbye to our solar system. At 9 light years from home, we start seeing the 3D moments of our neighboring stars. The blue sphere represents the distance our radio signals have traveled into space. It has a radius of roughly 90 light years. We are looking at the Milky Way, our galaxy and home to approximately 300 billion stars. But soon we say goodbye to our galaxy and start getting a glimpse of other galaxies, each represented by a colored dot and each home to billions of stars. We estimate that there are between 100 and 200 billion galaxies in the observable universe. Our trip is not only to the farthest reaches of the universe, it's also a journey back in time to its origin. This is the universe. The sphere represents the background radiation of the Big Bang close to 14 billion years ago. We have returned home, but so let's pay a visit to the International Space Station. This wonderful construction, our humanity's outpost in space, is over 100 meters wide and normally houses six people living there permanently. During this five weeks course, we will visit the space station several times and talk to how do we build it? How do we operate it? What do these astronauts do there? We will talk about the past of human spaceflight, we talk about the present, and the future, how we prepare the future exploration by living on the ISS right now. 